Hey all, hope you all are good. Welcome to my channel, Sri World of Coding. In today's video, I'm going to show how we can set up uh, Linux inside Windows using WSL2. So, uh, as a developer, we face many challenges in which uh, where we are switching between different operating systems such as uh, Windows to Ubuntu or Windows to Kali Linux or other distribution of Linux. So one uh, we was we used to double boot our PC in which we install different operating system. Another way was uh, we install VirtualBox. So in VirtualBox, we used to install uh, VDI's virtual disk images, and then we used to start any other operating system that we want to use. So here you can see I installed uh, Ubuntu and Red Hat. But now this issue has been resolved. We can um, use Windows and any other distribution of Linux simultaneously. So let's see how we can do that. So what for, uh, first you need to click on Windows plus R. So a small dialog box will open here write app wiz.cpl and click on OK. So this window will open. Just click on Windows feature on and off. Just click on Windows feature on and off. So this dialog box will be opened. Now you need to tick two of the options. First is virtual machine platform and second is Windows subsystem for Linux. By default, these two will be unchecked. So after checking virtual machine platform and Windows subsystem for Linux, uh, you need to click on OK and restart your system. So when you are hover around, so you can see after clicking, it provides enables the platform support for virtual machine and and it pro uh, and thus for the second one it shows that provides service and environment for running uh, user mode linux shells and tools on windows so as i told click on ok and after closing this just restart your system so once your system has been restarted open open the command prompt with administrator so here you can see uh, your window has been uh, this your command prompt has been opened with administrator power so just write wsl hyphen hyphen install so if you have written wsl hyphen hyphen install by default it will install ubuntu we can change the distribution of Linux we are installing. So in order to view list of all the distribution, we need to write wsl hyphen hyphen list and hyphen hyphen online. So it will search uh, the name of distribution that are readily available. So you can see Ubuntu by default. Then comes Debian, Kali Linux, Ubuntu 18.04 version, 20.04 version, 22.04 version, and others similarly. Oracle Linux and Open SUSC, Leap, and other distros of Linux are uh, available. So, for example, if you want to install any other version of Linux, what we need to do? We need to write wsl hyphen hyphen install. hyphen distro d stands for distribution and here we, uh, we are going to provide the distribution name so here what it, we are doing we are installing uh, ubuntu version 20.04 so here you can see the installation has been started it will take some time depending upon the internet speed so let me resume the video once it's completely uh, installed So, so here you can see uh, the Ubuntu 20.04 LTS has been installed. So it is asking for your username. I will provide my username. It will ask for the password as well. Let us check. So I have provided my password. So it is reconfirming the password. 
so it shows installation has been successful now okay so now you can see you can see we are inside our ubuntu machine so you can yeah, you can see uh, whatever files and folders that are present at this path is being present here so if you go to the search button and you will search for ubuntu you can see uh, your distribution of ubuntu 20.04.6 lts is being present here let me try uh, exit and here back uh, if we write exit we are successfully log out from our uh, ubuntu machine in order to check what are the various uh, distribution that are installed in our system you can we can write wsn hyphen list hyphen view so here you can see uh, i have two version ubuntu 22.04 and 20.04 currently this is currently running and this is in stop uh, stop set and by default version is set to 2 this is set to 2 because i have set my uh, uh, my WSL to 2 so in order to there are two prerequisites set that we need to do when you are installing WSL for the first time first what you need to do you need to write WSL hyphen hyphen update so what it will do it will install the latest WSL version. Now, what we need to do, you need to keep it uh, in mind. Uh, we need to set the default version. So, to do so, it the command will be WSL set default version. D E F A U L T version two two. So, this will set WSL version two two by default, or for all the distribution of Linux that are getting installed. In, if you want to set run one of the operating system by WSL1 or other by two, what we can do? We can write we can write WSL set version. Then we can we need to write the distribution name. Uh, that is uh, that we have installed earlier. That is uh, you want to or basically you can we need to write here the dist distro name distro name and then space and then two now let's check uh, whether our uh, distribution is being opening or not so search for ubuntu this version we have installed so click on enter so you can see now we are inside our uh, ubuntu distribution this is our username 